Published, 1316 Eastern Standard Time, the 11th of January the 2018. Updated, 1525 Eastern Standard Time, the 11th of January 2018. His marriage has been plagued by speculation that it's on the rocks in recent weeks. Despite the furore, Kevin Clifton, 35, has defiantly stepped out in London sporting his wedding ring as he arrived for dance rehearsals with his fellow Strictly Come Dancing professionals ahead of their upcoming tour on Thursday. Although the BBC Ballroom star appeared in jovial spirits his other half Karen, also 35, was noticeably absent from tour rehearsals while Kevin arrived alongside dancers Gorka Marquez, Cater Jones and show judge, Craig Revel Horwood, scroll down for video beaming, Kevin Clifton, 35, has defiantly stepped out in London sporting his wedding ring as he arrived for dance rehearsals with his fellow Strictly Come Dancing professionals ahead of their upcoming tour on Thursday absence, although the BBC Ballroom star appeared in jovial spirits his other half Karen, also 35, was noticeably absent from tour rehearsal showcasing his personal style. Kevin donned a blue plaid shirt for the outing which he teamed with a navy blazer while wrapping a statement khaki wool jacket around his physique. The dancer paired his ensemble with a pair of baggy black trousers and warm-up dance booties as he arrived to the studio listening to Completing his look, he worked a navy baker boy hat and circular black framed specs while trying to offset his wedding ring with a number of statement rings. Mail Online have contacted Karen Clifton's rep and a spokesperson for Strictly Come Dancing. All in the details, completing his look, he worked a navy baker boy hat and circular black framed specs while trying to offset his wedding ring with a number of statement rings style savvy, showcasing his personal style. Kevin donned a blue plaid shirt for the outing which he teamed with a navy blazer while wrapping a statement khaki wool jacket around his physique stepping out, smiling as he entered the studio. Kevin was followed in by a casually clad Craig Revel Horde who arrived in a pair of grey mile joggers and an eye-catching quilted orange jacket smiling as he entered the studio. Kevin was followed in by a casually clad Craig Revel Horwood who arrived in a pair of grey mile joggers and an eye-catching quilted orange jacket. Following suit, professional dancer Gorka, who was paired with Alexandra Burke on 2017 Strictly, donned a matching printed tracksuit which featured elephants and a red stripe down his pants. While 2017 show hopefuls Debbie McGee and Ava Gadami arrived to the dance rehearsal ready to start their tour training. Meanwhile, Karen's noticeable absence from rehearsals comes after her and Kevin's marriage has been plagued by speculation it's on the rocks, two years after tying the knot, with her reportedly enjoying a short-lived romance with a hunky accountant, eye-catching, following suit, professional dancer Gorka, who was paired with Alexandra Burke on 2017 Strictly, donned a matching printed tracksuit which featured elephants and a red stripe down his pants ready, while 2017's show hopefuls Debbie McGee and Ava Gadami arrived to the dance rehearsal ready to start their tour training dance to it, EastEnders starred Ava down a wine-colored jumper and navy joggers for the rehearsals ballroom banter, Strictly pose Nadia Bychkova and Katja Jones arrived together but the Strictly Come Dancing professional, 35, hinted that she was staying strong in the face of her troubles in a defiant Instagram post with an entry from her journal that included the words, self-destruction is not an option, the post reads, wake up early tomorrow, eat a good breakfast, do your hair and Make up and put on a kick-ass outfit. Buy your cup of coffee and enjoy every sip of it. Go to work, make that money, and learn something new in the process. Nourish. Grow. Inspire. Self-destruction is not an option. And let every choice you make be a brick in the foundation of rebuilding yourself. Waltzing in, Marius Lepior and Otima Booth held hands as they arrived delight, strictly pose Neil Jones and Chloe Hewitt stepped out for the dance rehearsal Scarin wrote alongside the post, 2018 Happy New Year, the dancer is thought to have spent the festive season without her husband, also 35, as they give one another space, although they are scheduled to be performing alongside one another in a nationwide dance tour, from May. A source told The Sun ahead of Christmas, Karen will fly to New York and spend it with her family while Kevin plans to travel up to Grimsby to be with his. Right now they are just trying to get through the last two weeks of Strictly and then need some space. Self-destruction is not an option, defiant Strictly dancer Karen Clifton has hinted at staying strong amid marital woes with husband Kevin in social media post pictured in April her love, Karen also shared this snap of herself with her rescue dog, but there was no mention of Kevin they will get back together after Christmas and decide what they are going to do. Right now their marriage hangs in the balance and their future together as a couple looks very uncertain. Kevin and Karen married in an idyllic ceremony in July 2015, with a bevy of superstar guests however earlier this year they were first hit with reports of strife.
Speaking about his wife after their wedding, Kevin said, We have such a good laugh together all the time. My life would NT be what it is today if it WASNT for Karen. SHE's perfect. SHE's always been my best friend. Adding fuel to the fire Karen and husband were seen keeping their distance from each other while attending the wedding of Strictly's artistic director and choreographer Jason Gilkerson in Liverpool on Thursday Karen is said to have become embroiled in an affair with accountant Stuart Wood however the couple are said to have split at the end of last month. Insiders told The Sun, it was never a long-term thing and Karen realises that she made a mistake. She ended things with Stuart shortly after the news broke. He is heartbroken as he thought they had a future together. Karen and Kevin were most recently seen keeping their distance from each other while attending the wedding of Strictly S artistic director and choreographer Jason Gilkerson in Liverpool on Thursday. They were joined by a bevy of stars, old and new, from the BBC hit series, including Karen's claimed love rival Louise Redknapp, 43, Kevin's former dance partner, who had performed on the night for guests. Strained, Karen and Kevin, reportedly spent Christmas Day apart in order to give each other space, amid their marital woes, according to reports.